Hi guys, this is Tao and welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a haul for the products I picked up in the last several weeks and it will include skincare products all the way to just like makeup in general. So without further ado, let's get started. So first I would like to talk about some things I got from Mali, Mali Beauty. And I purchased this off of their website. The first thing I got is the Mali Liquid Face Defender Blush. I'm sitting right in front of a window so it's pretty bright but this is the Liquid Face Defender Blush and the shade I have is Carnation. I've worn it a few times and I really like this. So it is a moussey consistency and the color is a peachy, a peachy mauve which I would say pink but it rubs out to a kind of a mauve shade. It's a little bit cooler. And it's matte. It stays on absolutely amazingly. So I um, really like this so far and I'll do a detailed review and demo on how I applied this. So I have that and I also got a lip gloss trio and this is their volumizing lip gloss or something like that. I will link the product down below. Um, I purchased this with my own money and this just came in a trio and you get three shades. First up we have Pearly Girl. It's like a kind of a pearly champagne -y shade. And then we have a rose and I would describe this as like a dusty rose color. And lastly we have Flirty which is what I have on my lips right now and it's a kind of a light pink. All three have golden shimmers to it and I think the lip gloss is designed to make your lips appear fuller and I think part of the strategy is using the light reflecting um, shimmer to make your to kind of blur out your lip lines and make it look poutier. I really like the texture of the gloss. It's not too sticky. It's not too thick. It's not too thin. It stays on for a while and I feel like when I have the gloss on my lips do look fuller. They are on the sheer side though so keep that in mind when making the decision to see if you want to try it. But I got it in a trio and it's really good. Uh, it's a really good deal. So that's my Mally's haul. And then I got a skincare set off of Holt Look and it's by the brand um, Clarisy. Do you like the ocean? And I got a bundle with four of these things and this is a, it's all the sea salt solutions. And I it came in a set and I have the tone correcting clarifying exfoliant and this has tea blend, tea blend evens tone and sea salt clarifies. And then I have the Rapid Detox Charcoal Exfoliant that has charcoal in it and it dissolves blackheads and almond flower brightens and the sea salt clarifies. This is the Microderm Powder Mud Rub and it's supposed to re-texturize and um, it has powderized salt and mud crystal. I've been using this uh, recently, it's an instant glow powder exfoliant and it has almond flower which brightens, rose powder cleanses and sea salt clarifies. So all four of these have sea salt in it and what you do is uh, with the exfoliants, whatever, uh, you could use it by themselves or uh, like me, I mix them with my uh, cleanser so it's kind of a, you turn your face wash into a exfoliant. The salt particles are really fine so it's not like you are rubbing your face with actual sea salt like granules. So sensitive skin that gets red quite easily and I don't have an issue with using this product. So I really like that. I hauled some stuff from my local Walmart. I actually just picked up two things. So this is the Milani Flower Blush. This is in the shade 05 Coral Cove. And I have that on my cheeks today. Don't know if you can tell. But it's a matte coral blush that's just like straight up coral. I don't really detect any hint of pink in it. And on your skin, it's just one of those fresh uh, face brightening shade. So I have that. And then I have uh, two things from Wet n Wild. One is the Fergie On Edge Long Wearing Eye Pencil. This is one of the new ones, I think, and this shade is in China White. 
that's right there. It's more of a subtle pearly shade. I have that on my waterline. It stays on really well. It just brightens my eye without being too stark because it's more of a pearly shade. So I really like that. And then I am still trying to decide how I feel about this. This is the Red n Wild Calm Correct Celebrity Concealer. And it's in the shade Fair. But this product is really thick. Like I had to really squeeze the tube to get the product to come out. But once it's out, it covers pretty well. Um, but I do find it sink into my, uh, the lines around my eyes a little bit more. And then I um, went to Sephora and picked up a couple things and also cashed in some of my points. So I picked up, this is the Soap and Glory, a great kisser. I got this based off of uh, the Glam Guru uh, Tati's recommendation. Her lips always look so luscious and she uh, really raves about this product so I got it. And the shade I got was Peach and it was 10 bucks. so mm, it looks like that. I've been using it. Um, it does make your lips look really juicy and I just wish it turns my lips the same shade as this one But it doesn't it's a little bit more on the sheer side, but regardless it smells great and it feels really good on And then I got the Sephora. This is the brightening serum It's supposed to fight uneven tone and dull lackluster skin. It's anti-dark spot and radiance enhancing I got this on sale. It was like 15 bucks. It used to be 20 it used to be 30. I haven't really tried it yet. I will and I'll report back. And I got some of their hundred dollar per a hundred point perks. One is the Marc Jacobs uh, Kiss Kiss wait what? This is their lipstick and this one is called Kiss Kiss Bang Bang. It's so teeny, it's so cute though. It's such like a my lips but better shade. It's like a that neutral rosy shade. And then I have another one. This is the Pink Gel Coat. What is this from? LF? I don't know. But this is but this is their Pink Gel. And I have it on my nails right now. It just makes your nails look glossy. And it gives a really slight pink under, like a pink tint. But unless you're like really focused on it, it's not that big of a deal. Like you don't really notice it, but it just makes your nail so glossy um so i got that this was a hundred points too but that was a really quick haul and i hope it was quick and um i will try out those products furthermore and do more detailed reviews on the products i got if you have any um spe specific recommendations if there are products that you want to see reviewed first please comment down below if you've tried any of these products definitely let me know how you like them please subscribe if you haven't for more updates, tutorials, um, tabs, you know, things like that. And follow me on Instagram. It's I am grape 1119 And thank you so much for stopping by today. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.